Hey guys, it is, what day is it? Thursday. Still on vacation, just got back from J Tree. Still have a few days off, not really working my nine to five job, but I actually just got finished filming a Zara haul. Lots of good pieces in from Zara that I just filmed. This shirt dress being one of them. I'll show you guys a little sneak peek of the outfit. Very fall vibes over here. We are ready for fall. We're fully in it. We're prepared. I'm ready for fall, guys. Like, fall fashion is literally my favorite. I just love the fall time because it gets a little bit cold. It gets overcast. Clothes are so good. Like, literally my favorite. If I could live in sweaters and leggings and coat, all those things, every single day of the year, I would. <laughs> Maybe I should live somewhere else. Just got finished filming. Probably is up already because i think that'll be up before this video so if it is i will leave a little card up here somewhere and i'll also link it down below if you guys want to watch my zara haul motorcycles you don't even know the noise oh link down below if you guys want to watch the zara haul and see what i picked up for fall lots of cute pieces that i'm super excited about i'm also really loving this earring stack that I have in right now so I usually do my lily clasp earring stack with better to show you I'll usually do these big hoops and then I'll do a something else but I really like the way those look I decided to switch it up because fall video so I wanted to do like a little bit of a different like earring more of like a statement earring and I really like it I also did like more of a cranberry eye at least tried to um just to you know do a little bit of fall makeup now what's happening is i need to clean up disaster over here look at this it's a mess i need to clean up this i need to put my rack away see what i have to do with it it's freaking noise anyways and tyler's actual anniversary today so i know i don't know if i mentioned this but for joshua tree when we went that was obviously our anniversary trip but we weren't there for our actual anniversary day. We came back just because the price was like a little bit too much for us to stay an extra day. So we just decided to come back and chill here for our actual anniversary. So we're going to do wine and cheese because we used to always do that. Like when we first started dating, I think like that first year, every single month, month anniversaries are corny and they are. But to like make fun of the corniness and just to kind of you know, celebrate another month that we were together, we would do a charcuterie board. So we would do like a bunch of different cheeses and drink wine and like watch a movie or something. Um, but we stopped doing that. Like we don't really do it that often anymore. I honestly can't remember the last time we did it. Like it's been a while. We're gonna do that tonight just because we're not like in Joshua Tree for our actual anniversary. We still want to like celebrate the milestone. Three years, you guys. Three years is a long damn time <laughs> to be with somebody. So we gotta celebrate. So we have some wine, we're gonna go get some cheese, probably gonna make some pasta, something easy. And then tomorrow we are going down to San Diego to see my family, mom and see my dad. Yeah, just to catch up with the fam, see them. So I'm gonna clean up, <laughs> stop rambling. I feel like I'm procrastinating in like cleaning up. But I'm going to like fix my mess, you know, get my life together, snap away my mess. In three seconds, my mess is going to be clean. Are you ready? Three, two, one. All right, that is as good as it's going to get. I just like threw my pillows on there and I'm like, good enough. Changed into another outfit. We're going to get ready to go to the grocery store and go pick up some cheese because we don't have any. I'm just wearing this cross little crop top, tie front crop from Misguided. It was in my haul. I'll link it down below. My shorts are from Dish, my favorite shorts ever. And then I'm just wearing just my little necklace from Tyler. I like re-fell in love with it. I don't know why I don't wear it more often, but I'm just wearing that. And then the jewelry that I had on from filming. I'm really loving this ear stack. I don't know. Maybe it's the dangly. I just really like it. I'm gonna put on, I don't know what, maybe some sneaks. Maybe my my Nikes. I think that's what I think that's what we're gonna do. Love this bag from Zara. It's literally my favorite. I only 
wear this bag it's so good I tried to find it again but I think they just don't sell it anymore I got it in New York when I was there earlier this year for work and I immediately saw it and like fell in love because of the bead straps it's just so pretty and it really just goes with everything it just adds like an extra layer of just I don't know it just makes your outfit just makes it look a little bit more expensive so I don't know why I itched right there <laughs> I'm losing it. The shoes that I was talking about, these are the Nike 270s. And these are in like a beige color. These are like my favorite shoes ever. They're just really cute. Okay, here's the outfit. Just, you're on the stairs. Here are the shoes on. It's the full fit. Just going to the grocery store. Chill little outfit. I've secured the bag. Oh yeah. Gonna have our friend's wine. Our friend Nicole. Her family owns a winery in Zodovich Vineyards. And we're gonna have this estate Syrah from 2009. So Yum! Yum, yum, yum! This is what it looks like. Syrah, one of my favorite ones. That came off of the cork. It's like blood. That's the wine side. That's how dark it is. This is how dark the wine is. Soda bitch. Check it out. Careful Goodness. when you pour it so you don't pour all the sediment into it. I don't even think you could tell. Can you see that sediment? Look at that. Look at that. See all that? That is some good ish. Cheers. Cheers to three years. Cheers to three years. Saute. Saute. Oh, it's good. Mmm. Mmm. Whoa. This is 2009. So this is what, 11 years old? Yeah, Super. not harsh. I love Syrah. I just ran upstairs because my favorite lip liner, sorry, my lighting is like really bad in here. My favorite lip liner, the Brown Sugar by Kylie. You guys know that is my ride or die. It's this one here. Let me show you. Favorite lip liner. And this is all that I have left of it. Literally this much. I have worn this lip liner in just this color this is brown sugar by kylie i've worn it for i'd say at least two years like this is like my ride or die go to it's the perfect nude for my skin tone and if you're a similar skin tone as me it's literally the perfect nude i don't know what prompted me to check the kylie website and just see if it was in stock you guys for the past two years that I have been wearing this I have never been able to get my hands on another because her site is always out of stock she never has the the um, lip kit never has it it is freaking in stock you guys I have not run so fast in my life I was literally like I need to buy this ASAP so I'm telling you guys now so that when this video goes up eventually hopefully it is still in stock and you guys can pick it up because quite a few of you guys actually ask me like what lip liner are you wearing or what's your lipstick and what's this and I'm like I'm so sorry it's sold out I'm not even able to get it and it sucks because I know a lot of you guys really want to try it but like I said it's just never in stock in stock but right now it is so I am about to put three of those babies in my cart 
and I'm buying it. I don't care. I don't care. I'm buying three. I almost thought about buying maybe five, but I feel like that's a little bit overkill. Don't you think? But it's like, it's good to have them on back stock, but I feel like five is a little bit much. Right? I don't know. I don't want to buy... <laughs> Uh, I don't want to buy five and then you guys check and it's like not in stock. That'd be so sad. In stock! Finally! I am so excited. I'm about to get a new lip liner. Mm -hmm. Ooh, and I saved $10. Cool. It's free shipping. Should I get four? No, guys, I should only get three. <laughs> I'm like really sitting here debating if I should get four. Okay. Pay now. I got it. Ooh, 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 Yes. Guys. I got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Ah! I'm so excited. I cannot wait till they come. Okay, so it is the next day. Different outfit here. Just finished filming some content for a brand. Doing some content for them, actually, not for my channel. I do want to share the product. I don't know if I could share it. In real time, I technically can't share it, but I'm thinking of when this video will go up. Maybe I can share it with you guys. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. If I can share it, you will see this clip. And if I can't, then I will cut it out. Basically, you guys know, I have worked with Hero Cosmetics before. I did a video with them a couple months back with their Mighty Patch. It's basically like their little acne patches that you put on a pimple and it basically sucks everything out. You guys, those patches are my ride or die. Like, literally like are godsends for when you have a pimple. They just came out with this new product called the Lightning Wand. That will focus. It's called the lightning wand. So it's supposed to um, brighten and smooth dark spots. So it's a dark spot brightening serum. And the packaging is super cool. You open it and it has like a little button that you press. And it has a rollerball applicator. And then that's how you apply the product. So it's super intuitive, super easy to like understand. And I like the fact that it has like, you know, that little rollerball. It's just like easy. Boom, 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 just to get rid of dark spots. So I'm testing this out in real time for some content on their channel. But I did want to share this with you guys. Just know I'm trying it and I will keep you updated on my thoughts. I will leave a link down below so you guys can check it out. But I just thought it was a really cool new product that they did. That they just came out with. So yeah, that's what I just finished filming content for. We're going to get ready to head down to San Diego soon. I think I mentioned this earlier in the vlog, but we're going down to see some of my family that I haven't seen in a really long time. I don't know if I'm going to vlog that trip just because it's a little bit more personal. Like, I don't know how to describe it. I want to like take the time to just be with family and not feel like I need to capture the moment. So I may vlog, I may not. We'll see. We're going to head down soon. Just I need to finish cleaning up. You guys know whenever I film something, it's like a mess. But I wanted to end off the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And yeah, I will see you in the next video. Yeah, she be on the highway with the 24 sitting shotgun. Yeah, shorty got to take it to the boost train. Falling out the tracks in the autumn. Yeah, she be living on the west side. Shorty no boundaries, but she alright. Only for one night, baby, just fine. Baby, just fine.